All new at 5, CBS 46 uncovers the dangerous truth about this intersection in Douglas County. A car hit and killed a 10 year old girl here this morning as she crossed the road. Thanks for staying with us. The people who work nearby told us that intersection is dangerous because it does not have any sidewalks. I'm Sharon Reed and I'm Tracy Hutchins. The Georgia State Patrol says the 10 year old girl named Kennedy Patterson was crossing Maxim Road. This was around 5 o'clock this morning. She was with her siblings. A truck hit and killed the girl while she was walking across the street to a convenience store. Well, this afternoon, the child's heartbroken mother told CBS 46 she wants to see something done about that intersection. Whatever it takes to keep pedestrians safe, you know, walking in that area because, you know, to lose a life is, you know, I mean, you can't get that bad. State troopers say Patterson was not in her cross crosswalk. They also told CBS 46 the driver will not be charged because it was too dark to see the little girl crossing the road. But we asked a Georgia State Patrol spokesman if this crash will lead to any safety changes. The spokesman told us contact Douglas County for the answer. So we did, and we asked why that intersection does not have any sidewalks. CBS 46 Traffic Solutions reporter Vince Sims is live in Douglas County to tell us what he's uncovered. What did they say, Vince? All right, we're live right on the Douglas County, Cobb County line, and this is where that accident happened. That little girl was crossing the street right here. But here's the thing, where I'm standing in Douglas County, there are no sidewalks. But if you look just down here on the other side of the intersection where Cobb County begins, that's where the sidewalks begin. So why are there sidewalks there, but not here? I went in search of answers from the Douglas County leader over this area. The tragic death of 10 year old Kennedy Patterson killed while crossing Maxim Road in Douglas County raises concern for people around here. It's just really dangerous right in here. It just seems like Robert Whitaker works nearby and has seen several close calls. I come down through here too fast. You know, a lot of traffic too. We found makeshift memorials in honor of two other people killed at this intersection. The latest was a woman walking in 2014. Georgia State Patrol does not consider speed a factor in the death of the 10 year old Thursday, so the driver won't be cited. But there is a lot of traffic with 27 to 29,000 cars using part of this road daily. That's a dangerous situation for the many people our camera caught walking through this area. Georgia has seen a 40% increase in pedestrian deaths in the past two years. 82% of those deaths happen in the overnight hours like this one. This intersection sits on the Cobb and Douglas County line. The Cobb County side has a sidewalk. The Douglas County side does not, but you can see where people still walk without one. So I called Kelly Robinson, the Douglas County Commissioner for this district to ask why there are no sidewalks. Hi, this is Vince Sims with CBS 46 News, checking to see if Commissioner Robinson might be available. The commissioner told me the county is actively working on it. The county is in a design phase to address lighting and sidewalks in this area. But people in this area say sidewalks are definitely needed soon. Probably need to install some if people's going to be walking across this street, you know what I mean, or beside this road. All right, you're looking back out here live now where the sidewalks are and where there are no sidewalks. In just the last hour, the commissioner was able to give me an update saying design phase is about 90% complete right now. He said if everything goes well, construction could begin next year and last about 18 months. It's going to begin at Thorn Road and then work its way back here to the county line. Of course, we'll stay on top of this for you. Reporting live in Douglas County, I'm Vince Sims, CBS 46 News. Vince, thank you.